Hi, Steven. This is Stud Doogie, your friendly neighborhood vault hunter and forum busybody. I uh, saw your post on the forum about not being able to fast travel and navigate the map because of how the scaling is done. Well, guess what? I have the same issue and I felt the same way that you did, but it turns out that there is a way to deal with it, so I just wanted to bring it to your attention uh, in a video because it's easier to show you than it is to try to describe it in words. Well, typed words. I'm still using words. Um, anyways, as you can see, I'm suffering from the same issue because, for example, I cannot navigate right now uh, using the menu system on the left to any of the Proven Grounds below Ghost Like Beacon, but guess what? It doesn't matter. Gearbox has actually created a really awesome interface that most of us were unaware of. I'm, I just scrolled my mouse wheel to zoom out, and we have the entire galaxy at our fingertips. And these points of light are locations and destinations on the map, so we don't actually need to use the left navigation menu. We can just navigate via the galaxy map. So, for example, um, Let's select one of these um, proving grounds that I cannot get to on the left side. I just click on it and I get to zoom in. And, and then I can just travel to the proving grounds that I can't access normally. Let me back out a little bit more and show you uh, the planetary stuff. So again, I'm just going to zoom out here with my scroll wheel. Um, and let's say I want to go to, yeah, sometimes it's a pain in the ass to select. Athenas. Uh, Athenas is not a good, uh, a good example. Zoom out again. Uh, let's say Promethea, because Promethea, no, Eden Six has many locations. So once you've zoomed, you've clicked on the planet, then you can use the mouse to select the location on the planet using the map interface or the planetary interface. So we don't actually need to use the left side, we can just navigate via the 3D map. So um, hopefully that helps you out. The other way to deal with it, which is really stupid, but you shouldn't, but I think the map interface is easier, is you can do this. Um, you go to options, you go to visuals, and what you do is you change from uh, whatever your display, display mode is to full screen, and then you adjust the aspect ratio, let's say 6, 9, and a smaller resolution. And then you say yes, uh, and then when you do this, it, it's, it's back to being normal, ugly as hell, but normal. And then once you've gotten to the planet you want to get to, or the location you want to get to, you know, let's say we go to Ambermire real quick. Um, then you just change it back to what it's supposed to be. But, you know, that's just more cumbersome, I think. I think you're just going to be better off using the, uh, the 3D map interface. Yeah, so, nope, not social. Oh, come on, mouse. That's the problem when you change it that away. Uh, we're windowless. Hit escape. We apply it. And we're back to it being weird. All right. I hope that helps you out, and uh, have a great day.